hi guys welcome to my videos so guys today in this video we are going to see how to apply an e-visa to iran before i proceed further if you have not already subscribed to my channel please go ahead and subscribe right now and also i would like to clarify neither i am an immigration consultant nor i am a government body so if you take anything out of this video you do it at your own risk all right guys so let's proceed so guys for the purpose of tourism e-visas are becoming popular around the world with the ease and convenience of applying and also processing, people are opting for e-visas rather than traditional visas at embassies. But yes, exceptions always apply like some countries are yet to implement and some countries allow these visas for specific nationalities based on their diplomatic relations and other uh, reasons. Alright, so in front of you I have opened this uh, Islamic Republic of Iran Ministry of Foreign Affairs and as you can see, we have the option to navigate through the site in four languages okay and just why i want to clarify that uh, neither i'm an immigration consultant nor i'm a government body so if you take anything out of this video you do it at your own risk all right guys so here for individuals and uh, travelers uh, we have the option to apply now like uh, this is the first step in our application some people make uh, qualify for visa without interview okay some visa applicants will need to attend an interview okay so if you want to uh, get more information you can always click on this and you can get more information We have browser requirements given, needed documents given. Okay, and once we are through all of this, you can always uh, start your app, start a visa application. Okay. All right. So now first is gonna check the eligibility. Okay. So visa type what you need entry tourist pilgrimage service transit press tourist urgent so let's say you want to visit the country next question very important your nationality so i select india sample type of passport ordinary place of issue do i have uh, Wow. This is a strange question. Okay, so this question is for the embassy or consulate at which you wish to either submit your documents or collect visa. Okay, so if you are in India, you will be doing it in uh, India, right? They should have an option. I am not sure if they have in India. Bangkok, Baghdad, Karbala. I think they should have in New Delhi. Lot of countries have yeah so not only in new delhi they have in new delhi mumbai hyderabad so whichever location you want to go that's in new delhi now and you need to put the security code let's see save and proceed so you need to provide your name personal photo so let's see what are the steps so nationality you need to provide your name as per your passport they have asked for father's name gender place of birth matters of occupation personal photo they have given the size also uh, applicants phone number applicant cell phone number wow both applicants outside in an email Additionally, very important zip code, residential address, phone number, 
now step 3 is passport information passport number ok passport copy step 4 visa information if you click on urgent you will be charged 50% more arrival date ok so good thing is like in a single page they have put all the information and in the next page uh, you'll be paying the fee and from there uh, they will like process your application and they will let you know if you can uh, if you'll be issued a visa that you can use to travel or if you can uh, or if you need to attend an interview that uh, as we had seen uh, earlier okay so that's how simple it is guys uh, to apply so thanks for watching this video guys please subscribe to our channel thank you